Hey guys, this is WhatsApp290 here with another tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to set up port forwarding on a Netgear router. Um, I'm pretty sure that Netgear is the most popular brand of routers there are. This is a tutorial for, for like if you want to use an application that connects to the internet, but uh, it can because your router is blocking, the, blocking that port. Here's how you change that. So what you want to do is open your web browser. I'm using Google Chrome, but any web browser will be fine. Is you paste that in and uh, press enter. Then what will happen when you press enter? is that um, it'll come to a page that asks you for like your router's username and your IP address. Um, in the username, you type admin, then the default password is going to be either password or 1234 unless you changed it. So once you do that, you'll get to a page that looks like this, except for always be displaying like your public IP address and all that. Um, and uh, what you do is you click port forwarding then then there will be add, add rules type in like the name of whatever program it is that I guess that you're trying to get to be able to access the internet but you need to know what what ports this program is, is trying to use, both TCP and UDP ports. Um, then you type, then you type the um, what port you'd like to uh, open. Um, what port here? Start port and port. You type what ports you'd like to your router to open for this program. So, like, if I wanted to open ports one through twenty-two, just an example, I type start port one and 22 then you just click add oh yeah and uh, you type your internal IP address in here and um, that's it. it should be done right after you click add so and if you don't want to do that anymore then you can just delete it then you can just delete the little rule you just made Alright, so this is Russell 2090, and I am signing off.